Okay, let's go to page 339 and let's start with number 29. Okay, so solving for triangle, so you got to get your A, B, C, get your three angles. So small a, small b, small c. So theta equal to 30 degrees and a equal to 54 centimeters and b equal to 27 centimeters. Okay, so first let's go ahead and get the angle A. Okay, so go ahead and get sine A over A equal to B. Uh, so you need to get sine B over B. So multiply both sides by A. So this will cancel out. So sine A will equal to 54 times sine of 30 degrees over 27 so sine A equal to 1 and so angle A equal to 90 degrees okay now remember whenever you use a law of sine to find the angle you have to get your second possibility so A1 equal to 90 so A2 180 minus 90 still give you 90 so you got two of the identical triangles so this one has only one case okay so it's just equal to 90 degrees so notice that this is going to be a 30-60 spatial triangle, okay? So use 180 minus 90 minus 30 will give you 60 degrees. Now you can use a, you can use the the spatial triangle to find this, or you can just using the regular uh, law of sine. Okay, so C over sine C equal to B over sine B. It's multiplied by sine C. So this cancel out. So C equal to B is 27 sine of 60 degrees for C. And you got sine of B is 30 degrees. You enter all that, you get C equal to 46.765. So you have to run out to 47 uh, centimeters. Okay. okay, let's go to the next one. 31 uh, okay. okay so you got a b c you got a b c okay so 31 so b is 57 degrees Small a is 47 feet, and small b is 62 feet. <clears throat> okay, so let's look for angle A. So you're going to get sine A over A equal to sine B over B. So multiply by A on both sides to cancel it out. So sine A equal to 47 times sine of 57 degrees over B, which is 62. So sine A equal to 0 0.635767. So angle A equal to 39.4768 degrees. Again, whenever you're using the, ang uh, the law of sine to find angle, you have to get second possibility. So A2, okay, so 180 minus that, we give you about 140.5 degrees. And this is no good, okay? Because if you put 140 over here, this is gonna be over the, for one thing, it's gonna be over the uh, 180, okay? Also notice that if A, if A is 140, then you got big angle, have the shorter side, so it's no good, right? Remember, bigger angle, how to face the, the, the the bigger angle, how to face the longer side. Shorter, small angle, shorter side, right? Okay, so this will give you 39 degrees, okay? So again, this one cannot be 140, because if it's 140, then you're gonna have big angle with a short side, small angle with a big side, longer side, so it cannot, okay? So again, that's how you're able to eliminate the second possibility very quick. Okay, so once you get those two angles, then you go and get your 
angle C. So 180 minus A minus B will give you angle C of 84 degrees. Okay. And then to find to find C, you just go C over sine C equal to uh, B over sine B. Okay. So multiply by sine C. So this we cancel out. So C will equal to 62 times sine of 84 degrees. Then you got sine of B is 57 degrees. Enter all that, you got C equal to 73.52. So when you come up here, you have to run it up to 74 feet. Okay, and that's it for number 31. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, number 33. Got A, B, C. And so A is 150.7 degrees. You got A, B, C. So you got 26.4 inch. And you got 19.5 inch. Okay, so right away, you know, there's be, there would be no solution, okay? Because remember, bigger angle how to face the longer side. So notice this is bigger than this, right? That means this angle has to be bigger than this. But if this angle is bigger than this, then three angle is going to be more than 180. So right away, you know that there would be no solution, okay? Now, if you don't see that, that can, you can just work it through. You're going to get sine A over A equal to sine B over B. Okay, so multiply by A, multiply by A, so this cancel out. So sine A equal to 26.4 times sine of 150.7 degrees over 19.5. Okay, and it, when you use your calculator, okay, 150.7 sine times 26.4 equal divided by 19.5 equal okay and then sine a equal to 0 0.6625 uh, equal second sine okay so angle a will equal to 41.5 degrees so if you put in here Again, some, there's immediately, there, there are a couple things wrong, okay? See that? This is more than 180 already, and the shorter angle with the longer side, big angle with the shorter side, so it cannot, okay? So, it can, so if you work it through, you can see that there, it would be no solution, okay? Again, it's impossible, okay? Again, so that's how you check, okay? So again, three angle, how to equal to 180, and the big angle, how to go with the longer side. Okay, smaller angle goes the, the, the shorter side. And the middle one goes the middle one. So you have to be that way. So anything that does not go that way, then would be the end, the triangle is no good. There would be no solution. Okay. <clears throat> okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, 35, angle A is 130 degrees and 20 minutes, B is 31 degrees and 30 minutes, and small c is 37.2 centimeters. Okay, so you can have to find angle C, so 180 minus A minus B will give you C of 18 degrees and 10 minutes. And then from here, you can look for A. So A over sine A equal to C over sine C. Multiply both sides by sine A. So this will cancel out. So A equal to C is 37.2. Sine A is sine of 130 degrees and 20 minutes over 
sine of C is 18 degrees and 10 minutes. Okay, so you have to know how to use your calculator for the degree, minutes, and seconds. So enter all that, you get 90.952. Okay, and so when you come over here, you need to put down 90 point, actually you have to run it off to 91.0 centimeters. Okay. okay, because again, over here five, you run it up, so zero nine will give you one zero. Okay, so you have to know how to run, run off your answers. Okay, so to find B, okay, you go, you do the B over sine B equal to uh, C over sine C multiplied by sine B on both sides. Again, don't skip steps. Okay, so when you write out a step, it helps you to think. Okay, okay so C, small c is 37.2. Sine of B is sine of 31 degrees and 30 minutes. And sine C be sine of 18 degrees and 10 minutes. Okay, so B equal to 62.341. So when you come up here, you need to put down 62.3 centimeters. Okay. Okay, next one. Okay, number 37, <clears throat> okay, you got A, B, C, you got a small a, small b, small c, okay, so b is 22 degrees and 10 minutes, and small a is 56.3 millimeters, and b is 25.1 millimeters. Okay, so first we need to find A, so let's do that. So sine A over A equal to sine B over small b, and then times by A on both sides. So this will cancel out. So sine A equal to 56.3 times sine of 22 degrees 10 minutes over small b is 25.1 okay so sine a equal to 0 0.846299 so angle a equal to 57.81 degrees but you have to use the, the degree minutes and seconds so a equal to 57 degrees 48 minutes and 41 seconds okay so that's your a1 okay so I'm gonna put it I'm gonna run off to see this is the nearest 10 men uh, 10 minutes so I'm gonna run off to the nearest 10 minutes so this would be 57 degrees and 50 minutes okay okay now a1 is equal to that so a2 so I need to get a2 so 180 minus that okay will give you one 22 degrees and okay so use 180 minus that so be 122 degrees and 10 minutes okay okay so this one has this one's gonna have two triangles okay so right away you're gonna so this is a1 and so this be a2 Okay, so again, as soon as you get your A2, you got to do that right away. Don't worry about the C yet. Don't, don't try to do the C and try to get a second triangle, okay? So you got to get all this information before you proceed because you're going to get confused, okay? So 122 degrees and 10 minutes. Okay, so from here, let's go and do this side first, okay? So 180 minus A minus B, this will give you 100 degrees. Okay, so to find C, you need to do C over sine C equal to 
b over sine b. So multiply by sine c on both sides. So this will cancel out. So c equal to small b is 25.1. Sine of c is 100 degrees. And then over sine <coughs> b is 22 degrees in 10 minutes. Okay, so you got to go and enter all that in your calculator. <coughs> Okay, so I get 65.514. Okay, so when I come over here, I need to put on 65.5 millimeters. Okay, so that kind of take care of this side. Okay, so now we have to come on this side. So I can use 180 minus A minus B, I get C of 35 degrees and 40 minutes. To find C, I'm going to use C over sine c equal to b over sine b so multiply by sine c so this cancel out so c equal to 25.1 times sine of 35 degrees and 40 minutes okay over sine of 22 degrees in 10 minutes and enter all that you get C of 38.7886 so come over here you put down uh, 38.8 millimeters okay just do a quick check so three angle equal to 180 big angle facing the longer side small angle short side Mid middle one middle one okay check so three angle equal to 180, biggest angle, longer side, smallest angle, shorter side, middle one, middle one, check. So everyone check, that means both are good. Okay.